Hi everyone, this is the Gas Walkthrough for September 17th. I'm Philip Newman. Um, struggling again today. Last week it was a migraine, and this week I'm just having the worst allergies. So hopefully I'll be feeling better soon and back on camera, but I do not feel up to it today. Um, but anyway, today's puzzle is Bark at the Moon by Bill Murphy. And this is a diagonal and Renban Sudoku. So we have normal Sudoku rules, one to nine in each row, column and three by three box. Additionally, we have these diagonals marked in blue, which must also contain the digits from one to nine uh, because digits cannot repeat and there are nine cells. And we also have some purple lines in the grid. These are Rinban lines and they must form a consecutive set of digits but those digits can be in, in, in any order. So for example, this could be something like five, three, six, four, because we have three through six just in an arbitrary order. And those are the rules. And one thing to note immediately in this is that along this diagonal, we have three triples. And we can figure out what those triples have to be. So one has to be on one of these lines. And it must go with two and three. So we have one, two, three somewhere. Nine must go on one of the Renban lines. And it must go with eight and seven. So we have seven, eight, nine somewhere. And then that just leaves four, five, six. So we're splitting the digits low, medium, high. And we can figure out which group we have in each case. So here we have a four, we have a seven. So this must be our low group. And this cell can't be three or two, so it's one. This can't be three, so it's two, three. Down here, we have our high digit. We have our low digit, and we already used the low group here. So this, this must be the middle group. This is five because of the four, six. And I don't believe four and six are resolved here. And then this is going to be seven, eight, nine, and that's not eight, that's not eight, so this is. Now if we look at the other diagonal, let's ask, can this be seven? If this were seven, where would we put nine on this diagonal? Well, it would have to go on one of the Renban lines, and a nine on a four cell Renban line would have to be nine, eight, seven, six. But we already used the seven. So that's not going to work. Um, the 9 is going to be left out here. And that means our two lines need to be 1, 2, 3, 4, and then 5, 6, 7, 8. Can we figure that out? Yes, we can. So none of these can be 3 or 4. So we can't put 1 and 2 in 3 cells. And we can't put both 3 and 4 in this cell. So this must be 1, 2, 3, 4 down here. The 2 can't go in this box, so this is 2. 1 and 4 are here, so this is 3. 1 down here makes this 4, 1. It's going to resolve 6 and 4. And now these are 5, 6, 7, 8. I can see a 5, a 7, and an 8 here. 7 and 8 here. And an 8 down here. And that is all the clues. So we are left with classic Sudoku at this point. Uh, where do we want to look? Five in this box. Can't go in those cells, so it must go here. We still need six, eight, and nine. Eight is looking in, so eight needs to go there. This is a six, nine pair. In this box, we need one, two, six, and nine. And I don't see much we can do with that. Maybe I'm missing something. Down here, two, three, seven, nine. Uh, three can't go in any of these cells, so that's our three. Two can't go in these cells, so that's two. And this is a seven, nine pair. These are five, eight, nine. Not resolved. Uh, in the center, we need a three. It's going to go in one of those cells. Yeah, not seeing that yet. Uh, these are two and nine. That's resolved by the two here. These are six and nine, which is resolved by the nine we just placed, and the six here. 
Uh, one in this box has to go here somewhere. So go ahead and mark that. We need one, two, three, four, and seven. I don't know that that's worth marking yet. Probably somewhere else we could be looking. So two in this box is here. Six is also here. That's what we needed. Now that we have the six placed here, two and six can't go in these cells. So these are two six. This is now a one nine pair, which is resolved. Seven in this row can't go in those columns, so it must go here. So our five, six, nine, and that one's not a six. These are two, four, six. Uh, the nine here resolves seven, nine. These are four and eight, which are resolved by this eight. These are one, five, seven. Can place a one there. These are three and four, which are resolved. What are we left with? One, three, and five. That's not three. Uh, seven in this row must go here. These are six, eight, nine, and that one's not eight. So now we have a six, nine pair here. So these are one and two. Places a five there. Result seven, five. This is a four. This is a seven. Uh, the nine here. Six, eight, nine. Six and nine. Five and six. Four and two and six and two. These are one and nine. These are uh, the five there. Eight and this is a six. These are three and nine. Should be resolved. That's going to resolve three and one. Five there and one and four to finish it off. So there are some things worth remembering about Rin Man lines that can see each other here. Um, so hopefully you can make use of that in a future puzzle. Um, but let us know how you did in the comments, and I will see you next time.